All right, Kara, after my eggplant fries or rings, you know what I can go for right now? What? A cup of coffee, nice cup ah, of coffee. Well, then our next story might make you a little bit jealous because Caitlin Francis is taking us to a local coffee shop with a great story. Take a look. Dom's Coffee is a dream come true for this family from Lithuania, the American dream. All American dream. Yeah, and yeah. living American dream. Yeah, in America, you know, it's everything is like run, run, run. You go drive through, you drink in your car, you eat in your car, you do everything on the way. And we kind of miss that when you go somewhere in the real place, you sit down at the nice table, you drink from porcelain cups, you have conversations, you have dates with your friend, with your husband, and our dream really came true because we see so many different uh, relationships here and so many new relationships that are born and we're going to the wedding parties already of our customers and it's just, it's great because we wanted to bring community together and just to show people that sometimes this half hour that you would spend with someone would really be a change. So Asta, her husband Andres, and his mother Gitana opened Doms named for their son Dominic. Yes, exactly. We all work for him. The desire to create a space for family and friends to gather led to building a community in Avon. This is beauty of life. You know, you never know what will be next day. And uh, that coffee idea, as Asta told, just born in a family dinner table. And uh, we just wanted to have something more special and something more like, I don't know, like lovely and cozy for all people around us. First of all, that us to say like, we don't know nothing before and we need more people. So this is how we start to build that community around us. And now if people come in and they say like, oh my God, Doms is like second my home. Exactly, This is, it should be some place in your life where you, should, you can escape, you can spend some you time. You come and you feel loved. They're supporting other small businesses like a local artist who created the artwork on their coffee cup. It's a map of the community they hold so close to their hearts. Our project with our cup where is local, other local businesses involved in that. We are very proud to be in Avon. We're very proud of all people who live here. And we are very proud of and supportive other business who are doing now it's a hard job to survive and to be strong. We will not survive without each other's support, so it's just like a map for the people who are coming maybe from different places that this is places we love, we trust, and please go. If you're supporting us, please go and support them as well. And people come from all over for their coffee and homemade food. From the um, sandwiches, definitely Turkey Apple Panini. This is our best seller signature, signature sandwich. Mom makes a special sauce that goes in it, and uh, it just really to die for. So, like six years ago, just by accident, we tried to mix local honey in our uh, latte, and this drink for sure became like one of the signature. most popular and. Uh, we go in with us, we like to travel around New England and different states and try different coffee shops. But for sure I know that this drink is just a dance. So if you wanted to have it special now in cold season, if you wanted to have something magical and delicious, honey latte. Honey latte. That's it. And the charcoal mocha is another really popular menu item. The pastries are also all baked fresh daily, and they also sell cheese, and soon they'll open a creamery next door. Lots of big plans in the works. Our biggest power is us. Yes. Together. Exactly. Family. Yes. Yes. With our baristas. <laughs> our baristas. All right, Dom's Coffee is on West Main Street in Avon. Ah, I definitely have to stop in for that honey latte next Sounds time. Sounds good, right? Delicious. Mm. All right, thank, and still to come on Great Day Connecticut, anger does not have to be a bad thing. Absolutely. I'm mad as heck, and I'm not going to take it anymore, Kara. We're going to talk about how you can actually use your anger in a healthy way. Great Day Connecticut will be right back in just two.